I think when, let's say last year, a couple of years ago for the last like five, 10 years, when you were ready to kind of make those switches, the market is much more fluid for you to say, you know, I don't like it here. Let me look for something else. And it'd be pretty easy to, or easier to transition than it is today. And, you know, if someone's watching this in the future, this is 2023, where we had strings of layoffs, the market is frozen. I guess what's your advice here? Is it just to kind of hunker down, wait it out? Or if you are in a situation that you're not a fan of, whether it be because you're not a fan of the kind of work you do, the kind of culture, and you want a switch, but then you're fearful of what the environment is like out there. I guess what advice do you have for, for someone in that situation? Yeah, I my advice just from an in, intuitive standpoint is don't move from a place of fear. And it's very common in careers as well to be like, well, I don't have enough experience or I have to do all of these things to get a promotion. Like that's a place of fear and lack, right? And I really recommend people to move from a place of abundance, come from a place of like, I have a message to share or I have a passion in this area or I have really something valuable to bring in this area and pursue that. And your last question, we talked a little bit more about the intuition behind like being willing to let something go for something better, right? The practical standpoint from that, the practical approach to that is going out there, like putting yourself out there. If that is a value that you have, be known for what you're doing in the world and interact with your community, interact with people, start sharing what you're doing because that brings you a lot more opportunities than you would ever imagine. And you never know who's watching or who's who's looking for the next superstar, the next you, right? Specifically you. And I think sometimes it's easy to be like okay well the job market's like this and everybody's like this but the reality of it is people are still hiring people are still looking and if you just happen to be there at the right time as someone's looking they're looking for exactly you you've got a match there it can be really hard to do that little mind shift right but catch yourself when you're moving from a place of lack moving from a place of like oh but this and this but also i have to do this because you don't have to do anything if you enjoyed this clip, make sure you watch the entire video, which has a lot more content just like this. And if you want to make sure you don't miss any of our episodes where we talk to leaders in the tech industry, from software engineers to product managers to engineering managers, make sure you subscribe to the YouTube channel and also click the notification bell. 